Welcome to What Wendy Wears. I am Wendy and I'm super excited today because we are trying out a brand that I have not had an opportunity to showcase. This is actually the first time that I am trying this brand. So hopefully all the pieces work out. Um, some of them, they look okay on the hanger, but we'll see how they actually look on. So we're gonna go ahead and try on the first outfit. <music> outfit is the two pieces it's the jacket blazer along with the pair of pants and I really like the look of this because it looks like a casual suit uh, especially because of the material this material looks like a linen blend um, and it feels like linen but it's not linen it's polyester like a polyester blend it is a little long and it's a little uh, wide here at the very top when it comes to the jacket what I like about the jacket is that there's no buttons, no zippers or anything. I wish it had pockets, but it doesn't. And all you do is kind of close it and you tie it here on the side. What I like about this is that it has this little fringe detail on the tie on the side and it's not removable or anything, which um, it's okay. I think you just have to dry clean it. The back of it is a pretty good length when it comes to the jacket as well. And I like the two pieces together. Now, one of the things about the pants and the jacket is that it has no stretch whatsoever. Here around the hips, I already busted the zipper because it got caught and I pulled it up and then it um, actually uh, ripped the zipper. So um, you do have to be careful when you're pulling it up. It does fit me a little fitted around the hips um, and the length of this is pretty long. I, if you are tall, taller than 5'5", five, five, this would actually be a very good length for you because um, it is long. And I think I have um, pretty long legs for a five foot five person um, because I have a shorter torso. Um, but when it comes to the length, it is kind of long. Like I said, I like the material. I wish it had a little stretch. I'm just gonna have to get the zipper um, fastened again. But other than that, it's a good suit, good quality, which I like, and I need to fix the sleeves because it's a little long. So the next outfit is only the pair of pants. You saw this blouse in a previous haul for Shein, and um, the pants, they're all right. Um, you know, things about this, when I opened the packet, they smelled really bad, honestly. I had to air it out. So when I left it in the, on the hanger for a few days, it, the smell went away. However, if you do sweat, you get that nasty smell that comes to it when I, I absolutely hate it. So when it comes to this faux leather pant, I like the style. I wish that it was probably about three inches shorter on the on the waist because I honestly think it's too high. My belly button's down here and this is way too high. I prefer more of a mid-rise. Um, it does have functional pockets. However, every time I try to slide my hand out, the pocket comes with it. Um, and uh, the back of it looks okay. I mean, I like the fact that they are wide leg and or straight leg instead of, you know, just a fitted type of faux leather pant. Um, and I do like the detail that is on the front leg, but overall too long. Uh, don't like the smell that comes along with these pants. So this is a no go. So the next outfit is this dress and I'm kind of on the fence. So you guys, can you please help me? Can you tell me what you guys think about this dress? So it has buttons here at the top and it stops right at my chest and then um, it goes down and it has a little bit of stretch and it also tears here on the side. So it kind of gathers the material kind of up and then from there, the side is straight. Now the material is textured. So if you could see that um, it is a textured material, it is polyester and it has some stretch. Now here on the sleeves, it does have buttons. So you have the capability of rolling it up if you like. Um, I'm kind of on the fence. I had to put the belt on because without the belt, I just did not like the way the dress looked. I don't think it has much shape without the belt. So let me show you what it looks like with, without the belt. And you guys tell me what you think. Do you like it better with or without the belt? I went ahead and paired it with some riding boots. And then I figured, you know what, to add some 
um, definition to my waist, I went ahead and put the belt on because it does have a seam here that goes around, but there was no belt or anything to, to tie. Here's the back of it. I mean, I think it looks pretty good. However, I don't know about the bottom part. Does it make me look a little wider in the hips? What do you guys think? Can you guys comment down below and tell me yes or no on this dress? Okay, so the next piece is this dress. And I absolutely hate it. I don't know who came up with this design, but it is all off when it comes to the proportion size. So um, it fits me well in the hips. Um, here at the top, I mean, I'm not a small girl. I mean, I am a uh, 40 CD going around when it comes to my bust bra. And this has a built-in bustier, and it also has boning here in the front. No boning on the side, no boning on the back. But it fits me so loose up here and also in the chest area. It just does not fit right. I'm gonna show you a picture of what it looks like on their website here compared to the dress that I currently have on. So I'll go ahead and place it here. Now this dress has no stretch to it, has a zipper that goes along this side here. Nope, wrong side, sorry. This side here and um, easy to get on, but super wide over on the top portion. And then the back, I just don't like the way it fits. I mean, the top is just so wrong. I absolutely love the color. It is pretty thin when it comes to the fabric, but it's not see-through. Um, but this also keeps spinning around, so it just doesn't fit right. This is an absolute no. So the last piece is three pieces. It's the tank top, the cardigan, plus the leggings. So this is a complete loungewear set and it's super comfortable. That's one thing that I can tell you. Um, it's very thin and as you can see, you can see the band of my underwear underneath the leggings. So it is super see-through. I guess if you're gonna wear this around the house, no big deal. Um, it doesn't really close. I mean, unless you really pull on it because there is a lot of stretch to it. And I like the fact that the cardigan goes all the way down or the duster goes all the way down to practically my ankles, which is a really nice length. And I think that you could use this duster to wear with other pieces. Now, um, the leggings, they are ribbed. So if you look at this, just like the material on the duster, they are ribbed. And so is the rest of the outfit. Um, honestly, super thin. I am wearing a bra underneath. If you, if I wasn't wearing a bra, then you could probably see my nips through it. Um, just keep in mind, uh, that if you are larger breasted, um, <laughs> good luck. Cause this has no support whatsoever. So it's probably not going to cover your whole entire breasts. Just keep that in mind. Uh, the backside of the outfit, again, you could see right through it. It is high waisted and um, not my favorite folks, but I mean, it's a good lounging uh, outfit to be at home. So as I mentioned at the very beginning of this video, this is my first time shopping at Pretty Little Things. Um, some of the items were okay, others were pretty bad. Uh, would I shop with them again? Probably not, unless I was really in a crunch and I needed certain things. Their timing when it comes to delivery probably took a total about two and a half weeks for the items to get here because they are shipped from overseas. Um, somewhere in Europe, I want to say they came from England, but I'm not quite sure. Um, but just know that they do come from overseas. All of the items that you saw in this video are going to be linked below. So if you are interested, you could always head on over to the Pretty Little Things website and purchase those items there. If you want to see how I style some of these pieces in my videos, uh, please head on over to my Instagram page at what Wendy Wears. There you'll be able to see reels on it, what I put together and how I put it together. So I'll see you guys in the next one. I placed a video here that you might like, and I also put my image here at the top. So if you're interested, you could just hit my image and hit subscribe and you are all set. I'll see you guys in the next one and stay stylish, my friends.